Hello everybody and welcome back to another video inside of my Minecraft Xbox 360 title update 9 survival let's play. So right now my inventory it's it's kind of a mess right now and the reason um for that is I died. So uh, that that happened in between last video and this video. The only reason was was because I was putting the uh, the 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 person into the com for this episode and into the community hall. That that's the only thing that I want to do in between videos. Nothing else. In just that one time, that one time out of all those times since I was in the sign, um, I I just heard a creeper start to explode behind me, and there was there was absolutely nothing. That I could do so I, I guess one of the things I'm going to be doing in this video is repairing the damage that the creeper did I mean it's kind of, it's kind of unfortunate but it, it was a night time I chose to not sleep for some reason I, I just thought eh, it would probably be fine anyways but it, it did not turn out fine so uh, yeah you can probably see the uh, the damage that was done but since I'm down here I will say who has been added to the community hall in this video, and it is Lost Crisper the Tamed Ocelot. So, uh, yeah, Lost Crisper the Tamed Ocelot have just been making a bunch of suggestions in the comments and just making a bunch of nice comments. So, um, yeah, welcome to the community hall. So, yeah, I'm gonna, I think I have enough wood, so I'm not all that too concerned about the wood here. But, um, is, is that good? I think I need a bit more logs here. So, it'll go like this. And then, there we go, that's fixed. Now I'm gonna need a couple more planks. And yeah, I think, do I need one more piece of glass? I think I do. Okay. So I'm gonna place that, oh, actually no, it's three, never mind. So I'm gonna actually, I'm gonna dump, oh no, I don't want to get rid of my bone meal. Okay, so I'm gonna dump a bunch of the stuff that I have in my inventory into my chest. And then I can look around to see if I have some glass. If I do, that'll be very nice. But I also might not, oh wait a minute, I have a trapdoor in my inventory. There was a broken trapdoor down there. Alright, I'm gonna quickly, I'm gonna quickly place that down. Alright, there we go. Oh, and also, I need a yellow flower as well. Oh, wait. Oh, I need, I need two more, one more trapdoor. Okay, I need to, need to get right on that. So, if I place it on crafting table and make some planks, I should be able to make the trapdoor. Yeah. All right. So, there we go. That is the trapdoor all placed. And so now... I'll get this. Oh wait, what what was that? Why did the why did the trap doors open when I broke that? That was a little bit weird. Okay. So yeah, let's see. I sh I should also probably harvest some of these crops here. Okay. So yeah, that chest is all full. Oh, you know, actually, to save space, I'm gonna I'm gonna just see if there are any blocks that can go in here. All right, there we go. Okay, so yeah, I got a decent amount of stuff in my inventory, but I'm gonna have to put the rest into here. So, I don't wanna accidentally put some stuff that I don't want in there, in the chest, or well, that I want in my inventory in the chest. Okay, so yeah, that's probably, probably good. I might get a stack of dirt just in case. And, um, yeah, so I think, I think that's good. I think that's good. Okay, so now what I want to do now is make the actual pathway over to the community hall. So if I, I, I don't have any gravel, do I? No, I don't. All right. Well, I'm, I'm actually, before I do that, I'm going to get all these blocks. Is there just, is there no actual tool to break the melons? Hmm. Alright, you know, actually, this reminds me here, I really do need a better spot to plant my melons. Because, I mean, this is kind of, right here, this is kind of ruining the whole garden right here. Okay, I'm also gonna 
harvest all this wheat since I rarely do that. Just been sitting here grown the whole time. All right. I'm gonna do it row by row to make sure that I get everything without having to jump in the water or something. Okay. So now the final row right here. Actually, how how much I get 40 wheat. Okay, that's that's nice. All right. So since I just got a ton of wheat, I might as well uh I might as well breed some of my animals. So if I open the gate, I can let this sheep come in. There we go. Then here now. There we go. And so now I'm going to I'm going to breed all these sheep here. I don't really need more sheep. Uh, yeah, I don't really need more sheep, but it's, it's better to have more. And also, I have to kill a couple in here, because they're in the cow pen. How how did they even get in here? Okay. Alright, so... Sorry, sheep. I'm gonna have to kill you. Alright, and now all these cows can breed. There we go. Is there still one cow that needs to breed? Alright, yeah. Okay. So there we go. So yeah, I did another unfortunate side effect of dying. Is that I lost a bunch of my levels, so... Yeah, that, that'll be a little bit inconvenient, but... I, I It's fine, I can, I can get it back. Alright. So, alright, yeah, back to the gravel road right here. So, you know, I'm actually... I'm also thinking of maybe making the the ground beside the pathway here. I'm g maybe make it out of blanks, just like this for for the parts. Or maybe I should just do it for this part here, and then I can place all these blocks on the side with oak wood. Yeah, I'd say that looks a bit better. So I'll grab all those blocks. And, um, yeah, I, I like that. So, now, I, I get gravel, okay. I need to get a shovel, though, so. I, I didn't know that getting gravel would take so long. It just, I keep getting distracted by other things, and it keeps stopping me from actually going to get the gravel okay so it's just past the river right here i just need to go down the staircase yeah there's a gravel gravel patch right here okay maybe out a stack of gravel might be good all right there we go so two gravel two gravel that's that's good progress good progress okay you know, also, there are quite a lot of ores in here, so I might want to... I, I did say one time that I wanted to get these ores sometime later, that sometime could be now. It could be now. Alright. I also do ne need experience, so mining this coal wouldn't hurt. Alright. You know, actually, that does remind me. I should go to the nether at some point. I can't stay in the overworld forever. So... Yeah, going to, going to the nether, that, that's, uh, that's something that I could do, possibly. And also going mining again, I might want to do that again, because there were some other parts of the mine that I haven't explored yet. So, so yeah, you know, I was actually, I was kind of getting a little bit concerned recently that I wouldn't have much to do in this world, which, I mean, it isn't that much of a problem, since it allows me to get creative with what I'm building, but... You know, when I think about it, there's actually a lot more in terms of the game's progression that I have to do. I still need to enchant, still need to just do a bunch of stuff. So, um, yeah, it's not, I guess it's not much to be concerned about. Alright, so, I'm at 51 gravel. That's nice. Okay. So yeah, 57 gravel. I mean, it doesn't look like there's anything else in this cave. So I'm just gonna... Oh, there's more gravel right here. Okay, I'm gonna get this. Alright. There we go. So now there's 
nothing else in this cave. So I'm going to go back up to the surface now. Yeah, I really... There, there's so much I want to do. There's so much I want to do. Okay, I really want to make something going down into the mine. I, I kind of... I, I was thinking of maybe doing a roller coaster of some sort, but I also that's that getting down somewhere. Roller coasters are more for fun, not exactly efficiency. So maybe maybe not. Or maybe 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 it doesn't have to be a fun roller coaster. It can just be one simple straight roller coaster going all the way down. That could be that could work out. Okay. So I'm gonna place these blocks all right yep that looks that looks pretty good that looks pretty good we got a little we got a little area right here oh this is this is nice this is nice you know i haven't actually realized how much i've built here this is yeah i like this i like this a lot okay so something that i've been meaning to get on to for quite a while now is enchanting i don't think i'm gonna enchant in this video quite yet but um if i could set up the enchantment table that that would be nice so do i have obsidian yes i do okay and so i'm gonna get some diamonds and also what else do I need? I need a book. Okay, I also have a bunch of books downstairs, so I need to remember about that. And yeah, I think I have all the materials. I can just make this now. There we go. So now I have the enchantment table. So now I need bookshelves, and that means a lot of wood. So I'm going to grab all the books that I have. Fortunately, in this version, bookshelves are very cheap. You just need paper that's it so if i just get all the sugar cane here oh you know i can actually i can craft it down here all right so yeah you can see i can craft a book even though i don't have any leather in my inventory look at this three paper for one book now that now that is an absolute tree deal if i've seen one okay so now i'm gonna make all of do I have any birch wood I could use? I oh, don't know. Okay, I'll just turn all these into planks. And then... In decoration. Bookshelves. There we go. Nine bookshelves. That's pretty good. But I'm going to need a little bit more. So... Oh, you know what? It's turning to nighttime. Okay. I'm going to go to sleep. I should maybe... I should maybe make a... Enchantment room somewhere in my basement where would it be where would it be though you know i could maybe i could maybe make it right in the middle here oh i do have glass oh i can that reminds me i completely forgot about how i need to repair the community hall okay all right i'm just i'm just forgetting all the all kinds of things right now okay so i'm gonna put away some of this stuff all right so yeah i could probably i would put it in here but the glass or not glass the map is there so i could probably make the doorway right here i'm not gonna i'm not gonna build in there quite yet but it is it is a good start okay so before i forget i'm going to go and place down the glass right here so one two three and there we go. It's like it's like, it's like nothing ever happened. Something happened. <laughs> okay. You know, I'm not going to go all the way back to the cottage to get this. I'm just going to shave a little bit off this tree here. Hopefully it doesn't mind. And there we go. Oak leaves, one block. So now this can go down right here. And there we go. So now what I need to do is gather up some wood. So I'm not going to do it up to there. I'm going to go all the way across the lake here to get some wood as usual. You know, eventually once a lot of the world is deforested, which I don't think that's going to happen in a while. But once it does happen, I'm going to need to set up some kind of 
free farm. You know, I'm actually, what I mean by completely deforested when I need to start making a tree farm, it's when I don't, I don't want to destroy all these trees. It'd be more out in this direction where I can't actually see from over there. That, that'd be more, that'd be what I'd be thinking about since, you know, I, I like the forest. It looks good. So I, I want to destroy it. But I'm fine with destroying the forest over here. Okay. So. Okay, that's a problem. I don't have any more iron ingots. Okay. I'm going to need to. Um, I'm going to need to go and make some stone axes then. Since I have cobblestone on me. Okay. Right, I'm going to keep that tree there. And so, yeah, also while I'm gathering up wood, I can also gather up flowers and mushrooms and that kind of stuff. Okay, I can't mind that one either. And so, I'm gonna keep the- f in the basement, I'm gonna keep the floor the same as in the main room. Because, <clears throat> it, it's just- it's- it's pretty cheap, it's just a bunch of logs, and that does include birch and oak. Since the tops, as you can tell, the tops are the same. So- if the tops are the same, then it, there's no difference, and I can, uh, I can use both blocks for the floor, which is nice. Okay. So I'm gonna break these flowers right here, gather them up, and, okay, so how much wood am I gonna need? You know, having a stack of oak wood, that'd be very nice, be incredible, actually, um, but I'm probably going to use it up straight away anyway, so I, I don't know. Uh, I'm sure I'm sure I'll use maybe about half of it or something, ideally. I still have some left for me to use later. Alright, we'll just see how much oak logs that I have after the axe breaks. Because you can see it's getting pretty low on durability. Okay. You know, as in, uh, in these these trees with the low leaves are kind of annoying since you have to break in to get to the trunk. Okay. There we go. The, uh, the axe is on some of its last blocks. Oh, there we go. Okay, that broke perfect timing. Yeah, very perfect timing. I have a stack of logs now. Okay, so I'm gonna make some... Uh, planks here. I have a stack of logs to spare, which is very nice. And I'm going to go back now. So maybe I'll pick up some saplings along the way. And yeah, so you can just from here you can just barely see the sugarcane farm. So yeah. And so I'm not. So I this is just a random thought, but I'm not sure how long I'm going to make this series. When I started it, I didn't exactly plan on doing it forever, which I also still don't think I'm going to do it forever, but I, I am having quite a lot of fun, so I can say with confidence that's not going to end anytime soon because I want to I want to keep doing this. But, you know, I might I might do multiple series on Xbox 360 edition because there are many different versions and I just think that playing on different versions for different series might be cool. So this one would be the title update 9 series. And I might do, I don't know, title update 19 or maybe even title update 75. I, I don't know. But yeah, so I, I might do a bunch of different series on Xbox 360 edition. But for for now, that's just, that's kind of, that's future me's problem, if I want to do that or not, because I don't know if I want to do that for sure. But, um, yeah, don't, that, that's not, it's not official or anything, it's just, it's just a thought that I was having. Doesn't mean it's gonna happen, just so you know, I'm not completely sure about it, but it's a possibility. Okay. So, I'm gonna put that log on its stack. And so, 18 bookshelves, I think that is good, maybe? Okay, um, it might be. Alright, so... If I dig this right here, so... The enchantment table would be 
right in here. It would be right there. I'm gonna need to make, I'm gonna need to dig out all around here. And now I need to make sure that all the walls around here are all destroyed. Okay, and also the floor can be destroyed as well. Okay, so yeah, this is gonna be a pretty small room as you can see, because this is about as wide as it will get five by five. Okay. I think it's just like the other room, maybe. Is it? Is the other room five by five? Oh yeah, it is. Okay, so yeah, there are two five by five rooms here. And then I can, you know, I don't have to dig all the floor. So I'm just gonna place down all of these bookshelves right here. I don't need to do it in the corners because you can't see them. And also I don't think it might not matter or it might, I'm not sure. So, but I can always build up maybe. So if I do this, how much does that do? What level? Oh, level 30. Is that, is that the highest level? I think that might be the highest level that it goes to. I'm not the most familiar with this enchantment system. Or, or, or is 30 the max with this amount of bookshelves? I'm gonna make some more bookshelves in case. Alright, five bookshelves. So, there we go. What is the maximum now? Okay, it still looks like it's 30. Okay, that's, that's interesting. Okay, I guess I guess the max enchantment is 30. So, I'm gonna just have to break these few blocks right here. And replace it with logs so it matches up. Okay. So, I need to wait for it to... Auto save. You know, actually, going to the nether might be a good idea sometime soon, because I really want to use glowstone. Glowstone is a very nice block for lighting the things up, and, yeah, just be pretty useful, because I'm not sure, do torches kind of make the, make the bookshelves less useful? I'm not sure. Okay, I'll just, you know... I think it actually might make a cool lighting effect if I were to place a torch up here and then it kind of have a light coming down right on the crafting table right up here. Yeah, all right, I'm going to I'm going to do that. Okay. So yeah, this is the enchantment room right here, which is pretty nice. You know, I'm actually going to I'm actually going to replace the ceiling to kind of match up with the other room. So I'm gonna place some of these blocks right here. I'll do that, and then the rest can be normal cobblestone. Okay. So I need to get this cobblestone right here. And there we go. So yeah, that looks, that looks about right. And yeah, you know, actually I'm gonna I'm gonna enchant something. I'll I'll enchant I'll enchant my um my pickaxe. Okay. So I'm at level eight. Can I get a level eight? Alright, what am I gonna get? Unbreaking two and efficiency two. Wow. Okay, that's cool. That's nice. Alright, so this is going to come in useful when um, mining. It's going to come in very useful. Okay, so I think I'm going to end off this video here. So hopefully you guys did enjoy this video. And I will see you all in the next one. Goodbye.